We're in Siem Reap, Cambodia. I'm here with my good friend Savin Philip and uh, Bora, who does all the hard work for us here in Cambodia, is pumping the water for us. This is a well that the Calvary Baptist Church donated. They donated two this time, and we can't thank you guys enough. Your sign says, uh, Jesus answered and said unto her, Whosoever drinketh of this water shall thirst again, but whosoever drinketh of the water that I shall give him shall never thirst. But the water that I shall give him shall be in him a well of water springing up into everlasting life. The woman saith unto him, Sir, give me this water that I thirst not, neither come now hither to draw. And uh, like I said, we partner, this is where Aqua Share, but we also partner with Savin and his wife Chobe's new foundation, a charitable heart foundation. Uh, and also we put the, the alphabet at the bottom of every sign so the kids actually can have fresh water and they have a chance to learn English. Uh, if they have someone that can teach them, which is kind of rare in these parts, but so we want to see. This is the this is the mom, and this is the little baby. So this is where the water is going to go to. This little girl will always grow up having fresh water. I love the little necklace; it's absolutely beautiful. How old is the baby? Uh, on you, man. Seven months. Seven months old. So how old is the mom? Uh, on you, man. Ooh, you tell my yeah. Twenty years old. Twenty years old. Very beautiful. Very beautiful. So, like we said, thank you so much to the Calvary Baptist Church. We're going to show you the house. Basically, this was a very, uh, you know, poor place to live here in this it's part got of Cambodia. a very small house before. Very small house before. Very poor. And a Christian organization, just like Calvary Baptist Church, saw how poor she was. Okay. Knew we were building a well, but they built her a house. This house, basically. Four thousand dollars, and they yep. built it in four days. And when you start looking at it, this is this is what Cambodia lifestyle is. They drag everything underneath because it's so hot. So a lot of times they spend a lot of time underneath. But the house itself, if Philip can, you always take your shoes off when you go up. But they have shown me if you follow me up here. This is the house, and you know what? This is this is a really nice little house. Yes. First thing Philip said when we walked up is they use bamboo on the floor, which is it lasts forever. It's soft to the feet, but this is it. Uh, this one does have power, and a lot of times they'll run the power off either a moto battery or a car battery. Uh, don't use electricity a lot. We'll use a fan most of the time. But this is very clean. It's got a tin roof. Most of the time a tin roof is very hot, but they've got it. Uh, open space here where the air can get through and look how clean it's brand new. This is Cambodia life. This is what they live in. This is what they sleep in. And uh, this little girl will always grow up. Fresh water in a brand new house. Thank you. Hey, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Yes, she's very happy with the new clean water. Do you want to go to the house? Yes, I'll go to the house. Thank you very much for donating a clean water well. A good try. It's our pleasure. Thank you very much. Thank you, Calvary Baptist Church. We love you guys. Saving lives here in Cambodia. We love you. God bless you.